on the investigation. With 4.34 more eight right? news now, investigators. Think, think about his mom that you saw talking, right? And think about her sisters, you know, her, the, the older people in his family that heard what happened to him. I'm not going to speak for them, but how are you supposed to take this, Ak, as far as the brothers? How are you supposed to, like, oh, well, it was just the one brother. Now it's a lot of the brothers. Keep it real. Yeah. A whole lot. At 4.30 from our 8 News Now investigators, a man who threatened several public officials going to their homes and leaving startling letters and items now faces new charges for threats that hit close to home. So that man is now accused of soliciting the murder of a judge, several other people, including 8 News Now investigator David Charns. And David, you were in court as prosecutors say this man wanted several people dead. Well, yes, and according to this letter, prosecutors say he wrote he wanted several people dead, including me. We previously reported on this man last year, and that appears to have angered him. Video the 8 News Now investigators obtained shows 21-year-old Charles Dowling outside of this home last year. He sprinkles something, leaving behind this, a mixture of eggs and other food and a knife. The home belongs to Assembly Speaker Steve Yeager and his wife, District Court Judge Bita Yeager. Prosecutors say Dowling also targeted the home of former Metro and Assistant Sheriff Tom strong. Roberts, who Dowling appears to have believed was That's Sheriff. A glider, man. Oh, shit. Yeah, That's well. a glider. I spoke too soon, buddy. Sure did. Yeah, man. Glad it, good, it, man. There wasn't enough damage done, man. Like, <laughs> like yeah. All he did was put some fucking eggs and shit on the fucking door. No son man would do no shit like that. True, true. The nostrils couldn't take that smell. Yeah, that's that's um this is this some weird old shit, right? Eggs and other food and a knife. The home belongs to Assembly Speaker Steve Yeager and his wife, District Court Judge Bita Yeager. Prosecutors say Dowling also targeted the home of former Metro Assistant Sheriff Tom Roberts, who Dowling appears to have believed was sheriff, and another judge, also leaving odd items in letters. Page 10, Dowling, Charles. Dowling was in court Wednesday after pleading guilty, but mentally oh, ill, Lord. to other charges, including stalking and extortion. It's a litany of threatening statements, including his hit list, where he indicates that he has several individuals on it. But prosecutors say before Wednesday's hearing, Dowling sent this letter to an ex-partner to, quote, finish the plan, threatening to murder the judge in the case, the prosecutor oh, in the case, Governor Joe Lombardo, and two reporters. Dowling continues the letter with talk about fuel and Molotovs for, quote, the biggest revolt the country has seen. Prosecutors oh. are asking the judge to allow for more charges to be filed, including solicitation to commit murder. Now, we'll see what happens here. Dowling was supposed to be sentenced for his actions last year, but that appears to now be falling apart due to the recent actions, which you just saw. His attorney is asking the judge for time to respond to these new allegations, and everybody will be back in court in two weeks. I'm David Charns, 8 News Now. All right, David. We'll mm. Glad her, man. Um, wow. Sad he, get, he get ready for the, uh, for the race war. Shit, man. Um, oh, what we got here? Also new tonight, gone in 30 seconds.